WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. Currently, we have a bit of a mixed bag out here. You've got the uh, Dow and S&P up. Dow's up 296 points, 300 points. That's at uh, 9 tenths of a percent to the upside. The S&P about 4 tenths or 16 points. The NASDAQ 100 up 4 tenths or 60 points. The semis are down over 1 percent. That's 35 points to the downside. Russell's up 4. You've got gold trading up 750. 1945 is the print there. Silver's up 7 cents. 2480. Lights recruit up. 69 pennies trading out at 96.72 and a 30 year it's back one point and five ticks she's trading out at 143.03 let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart we begin by take a look at the es mini trading right into resistance right now resistance is the center of its profile this is where both buyers and sellers believe the es mini is fairly valued fairly valued between the price point of 44.52 and 45.51 well it's 45.12 that's your resistance point if price is able to close about 45.12 today that's going to suggest to move up to the top of that profile at 45.51 it's a real possibility with that spot volatilics remaining below its 50-day exponential moving average if you take a look at the nq it also has a resistance point and that's up at its center of its profile and that's at the 14 683 level. U.S. dollar index looks strong. It's given back some of its early gains, but it's above its daily and weekly profiles. In fact, it's above all profile levels that we track out there. That suggests higher price. If we take a look at Goldilocks, still just been trading in that sideways range for the most part between 1924 and 1962. Silver's got a new profile that formed. It uh, confirmed last night. The support level is 2429. The resistance area is 2516. If you take a look at Light Sweet Crew, she's trading below her daily profiles, but the level really would need to take out would be the lows out here from the trading session of March the 15th. And that is 92.90. Otherwise, we just have some sideways movement out here. Natural gas, as we mentioned yesterday, it did complete a TD9 count top. And as long as price does not close above $6.44, that remains in effect. Now, it also has a new profile that formed, and price is at support. So it's really a neutral signal as we speak. It will remain neutral as long as price remains above $6.28. We're trading right now at $6.30. So you've got a neutral signal. Again, it closed about 644, says you've got a rocket ship to the upside. And then you've got your 30-year treasury trading lower again by over a point. Wants to continue to head lower. Stevie doesn't have any bottom signals for the daily time frame. Folks, do me a favor. Stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you're off to start your Friday, we want you to have a fantastic one. Thanks again for joining us, and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon.